Good day, everybody. How are you all doing? This is Dr. Nandi. Today, we are going to talk about types of data. I'll share my screen with you. It says, problem, identify the type of data in each case. A, time spent to check out at a supermarket. Number B, number of tickets sold at a movie theater. And C, percentage of body fat and D, color of a person's hair. So without uh, further ado, solve this problem. Start here, solution. A, time is spent to check out at a supermarket. Now, time is measured in minutes and seconds. Understand, second is a part of minute, like 60 minutes in an hour, 60 seconds in a minute. So it can be like um, 10.5 uh, minutes, which means 10 minutes and 30 seconds. So this is continuous. So this is quantitative data and continuous party. Then let's start with part B. Number of tickets sold at a movie theater. Now, this is also quantitative because we're talking about number. However, Tickets sold can be 100, 110, 105, 106, 107. Bottom line, you cannot sell decimal number of data uh, of tickets. Like you cannot sell 105.5 tickets. You will always sell whole numbers. So this is quantitative but discrete data. Discrete is something that can be counted, okay, and continuous. Quantitative continuous data is something that can be measured. So discrete is something that can be counted, something that can be listed. Continuous quantitative data is something that can be measured. Okay. Then on part C, percentage of body fat. This is also a data that has to be measured by a doctor or something. So it will be quantitative for sure but continuous. Why? Because it is being measured. And also it can have decimal values. Know, just for example, say 30% body fat. Okay. So 30.2% is also possible. So this is quantitative and continuous data. Percentage of body fat. Then part D says... Uh, Color of a person's hair. Now, the person's hair can be black, can be brown, can be golden. So, these are all categories. So, this is qualitative data. Qualitative and you might say this is categorical data. Categorical. Okay. So, I will stop here today. If you have any comment, you can always write me a note and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. I really appreciate that. Please let your friends know about my channel so that you and your friends can subscribe to my channel by hitting the red subscribe button at the bottom right corner. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Take care and see you next time when I'll bring an interesting problem with an interesting solution. Take care. See you.